What is good? I mean, what is really good, my people? It is UK, Trotter Brother, Dr. Blade, the darkest man who ran, and I finally, and I mean, I finally got round to watching Dr. Stone. Lord, oh Lord, have mercy. If there's been a time for you guys to get that fried chicken and get that Kool Aid, now is the perfect time because this UK, Trotter Brother, will be going ham. Huh? on this video so without further ado let me just get on this so first of all i gotta start off by saying that if you are new to this channel if you guys do not know the gist of things you guys know i have done this first impressions on series and whether their cheeks worthy and whether they're worth watching before i've done it with um dragon ball super i've done it with um Yu Yu Hakusho, which was the whole series pretty much. I do it with whole series uh, or first impressions depending on if the series is still ongoing. I've done it with JoJo's. I've done it with um, My Hero Academia. I've done it with One Punch Man. This is a recurring theme of me to do on my channel. I've done it before. This is something I've done multiple times. If you guys want to see my thoughts and opinions on those series, I've got a playlist. So just go, just go through the channel. Check out the playlist and then you will see what I'm talking about. But let's talk about Dr. Stone. And honestly, I gotta start off by saying that Dr. Stone is a good series. I'm liking it so far. I'm looking forward to the next episode. Keep in mind, I am only at episode two at the time of recording. I've only watched two episodes of Dr. Stone and I'm looking forward to watching more episodes of Dr. Stone because it's looking good. It is good, and I like the fact that it is different. It's very different. It's not your typical. It's not a typical anime where I see, I sit there, see a freaking shonen battle manga. Because honestly, going into Doctor Stone, I did not know what to expect. I thought it was going to be very action oriented, and this is very different. And the fact that it's very different, the fact that it's not action oriented, the fact that it's not a shonen battle series, it gives me a massive rush for fresh air. A massive breath of fresh air. Like, honestly, you don't understand how refreshing this is. <laughs> you don't understand how refreshing this is. And due to that refreshing nature of not just watching action, action after action after action after action, and seeing something different and seeing a series come at a different angle, it's, it's great. It, it's 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 amazing <laughs> it's amazing bruh but if you guys don't know what dr stone's about it's about um taiju and um i, I don't want to butcher this guy's name wrong so i want to make sure i get it right senku it's about taiju and senku senku is the main character a guy that loves science a guy that has the master plan to bring back civilization and if you guys do not know they have been stuck in a stone for a while because a certain event happened where everybody in humanity including animals as well some animals didn't get frozen but including animals as well a lot of them got frozen into stone only two people survived they were finding a formula to free everybody and rebuild civilization and they've been stuck in a stone in, in a stone for thousands and thousands of years and they're trying to bring back civilization taiju and senji and Senku, I mean, Taiju and Senku are trying to bring back um, civilization and they are on that quest to make everything go back to normal and try and bring the world back to what it was before. And honestly, so far, I'm loving it. I'm loving the plot. I'm loving the characters so far. I'm loving um, how they were both so determined not to pass out. So they put themselves in a situation where they refused to pass out and they saw themselves being in a position to try and bring everybody back to life. Or not really back to life, back to consciousness. So it's pretty cool to see, based on what I've seen in the episode so far, they've come up with the formula, they've come up with the master plan to do it. It's just that they've got a little stumbling block with a certain individual, which I'm not going to name because some people might not have seen the series and I want people to dive into the series and watch it for themselves and um, honestly it's a great series like I said it's refreshing off to a great start uh, based on people I've spoken to I've read the manga the series is in a very strong position and it's getting better and better 
and it's one of those series that I can see if it carries on going in that route it could end up being one of my favorite animes or favorite series out there as you guys know my current favorite series is Hajime no Ippo and One Piece those two series are the series I adore the most those two series are the series that I love the most and uh, I gotta catch up on One Piece I've been uh, distracted with football and other things as well been focusing on other things trying to build myself trying to get myself to where I want to be because as a sports athlete you gotta remain focused right now I'm nursing a knee injury and um, I'm gonna focus on recovery and on the meantime I'm gonna try and pump out some content for you guys but this is just my overall thoughts on Dr. Stone wasn't too much of a long video I hope you guys enjoyed it. Check out Dr. Stone. There's not really too much to say because I've only seen two episodes and I don't want to spoil people. But based on what I've seen so far, I am loving it so far. And it gives me that feel of um, Minecraft on uh, survival mode, if you catch my drift. <laughs> but anyways, I want to know what you guys think about this. Leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. The next series I'll be talking about is Baki the Grappler. Yes, I have been watching Baki. And that's a series I look forward to talking about. I've almost finished season three. And uh, actually, well, I haven't almost finished season three. I'm like in the beginning stages of season three. But Barky the Grappler is a series that I'm watching. And I will get around to talking about that at some point in time. But as a whole, guys, I want to know what you guys think about this. Leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. And yeah, let me just wrap up this video. So please comment and subscribe. I know I say this all the time, but at the end of the day, I'm just saying. Please like, rate, and enjoy this video. And yeah, this black man from the UK will catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.